and full disclosure, I'm a preacher's kid. Um, and so um, I'm a preacher's kid. My mom uh, is uh, the, the Reverend Dr. Karen Georgia Thompson, um, who is with the United Church of Christ. She's the ecumenical minister there. Um, and uh, what's been beautiful about uh, my mom's journey uh, in, and also my journey, I'm, I'm actually was raised by Southern black folks. Uh, and uh, we went to one of those Southern Baptist churches where um, where all that all that could be um, is, and all that you know, yeah, the unspoken things as well. Um, but that was a place of love and nourishment. Um, and my mom's journey, um, as I came out as queer, as I came out as all these different things, my mom left the Baptist church to move over to the United Church of Christ because she wanted to be in a place where um, all her children could be. Um, and also be loved, and also know a God, um, and uh, a God that loved them, um, un, you know, uh, unconditionally. And so, for me, uh, I believe my what feeds me is I'm a multiple religious belonging person in the sense of I honor my ancestors. I have um, Yoruba traditions. I am Southern and and Baptist, and so every now and again, I'm gonna break out in one of them good old songs. And I'm also I read my horoscopes and talk to the universe and birds. Uh, I play out and meditate. So all those different things um, are the things that kind of make me up and kind of feed me. Uh, and I think that um, if I am on my right path, then um, there's things that will be ease in the sense of, you know, if I'm doing what is justice and what is just, um, even when I, it, even when my skin tingles because it's a new sensation, um, I can hold that ground. And so um, I still go to some UUA churches, just so uh, congregations rather, um, so that I can be in the place. Um, but I am a student of uh, James Cone and Dr. Charlene Sinclair around Black liberation theology, but also I'm an organizer. And to me, organizers are the folks who can make what we think is impossible possible um, with heart, with grit, with love. I'm gonna sit with my folks. I'm gonna go turn up at the club so I can shake off the cares of the week and know that I'm with folks who are really trying just to survive and thrive. So it's all those things that feed me. And most importantly, my son, I have a three-year-old, Elijah Nason Lewis Thompson, who is my best teacher. And um, I just want him to be proud. So his smile is, uh, is my confidence that uh, I'm doing something right today, right now. So yeah.